so guys, I have some sad news unfortunately. Okay, the lamp is on. My toes are so freaking numb. Good morning guys, I am currently in the secluded wilderness of the Catskill Forest Preserve, which is located in New York State. I'm gonna be diving down in this beautiful swimming hole behind me today. There's usually always people drinking, partying, and most likely losing their belongings. So let's jump in with the metal detector and see what we can find. Drunk, I've never seen you clearer than now. We're flying high, floating somewhere up in the clouds. Going out of ourselves, can you feel it? Almost like I don't know if it's real Cause when we're doing our thing, we're the wheels that won't stop turning So take me on a trip, 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 nah Trip, 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 oh I flick the switch, kill the lights
My toes are so freaking numb. <sighs> Ouch. I can't feel them. Hey guys, we just got done metal detecting. It was so freaking cold. I've never been in such cold water in my life. It literally felt like someone took a dump truck of ice and dumped it in there. It was freezing. I lasted only about an hour, I think, but I was able to pull out some pretty cool things. Let's see what we got. All right, I'll start with the trash. We have a rubber thing. I'm not sure what that's from. An old rusty lighter. It might work once it dries up. It still hasn't dried out. Bottle cap, pull tabs, a couple of fishing lures. This one's pretty cute. Then our good finds of the day. We have some crusty coins, quarter, a dime, and check out this nickel. It has an Indian head on it and on the back there is a buffalo. I don't see a date on it but it looks like an older coin and it might be silver. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Next, we have this bullet shell I found. It says 45 auto, NR, uh, and I think it says C01 or 001. Let me know what kind of bullet shell this is, if you know. Now for the goodies, I have my diamond tester never forgetting this thing again. We have what looks to be a gold ring with diamonds. Some have fallen out. This looked much better underwater. Now that I'm taking a closer look at it, it might be a junk ring, but we'll test that out with the machine here and I'll confirm if these are diamonds or not. While this is heating up, check out my new hat. I know you probably can't see it because it's white on white, but it says sweat right there. <laughs> okay, the lamp is on. Now we can test these diamonds. <laughs> and nothing's happening. This ring is a fake. I'm still going to test the metal when I get home to see if it's gold, but I highly doubt it. Looks like a fake to me. Fake. Next, we have this cute little earring. Now this is actually gold. I could see the stamp on the stem and it says 18K. So this is an 18 karat gold earring. So we definitely have at least one gold find today, which is pretty awesome. It's pretty big too. This is a silver ring. There's a stamp on the back. I'm not sure if it'll focus now, but there's a stamp and it says 925. And there's some initials on the front saying SM or WS if it's upside down. I thought this was something gold. It looked like gold underwater, but it's pretty light and seems to be a little crusty. So I think that's just something metal. I don't think it's gold. And this earring, I got pretty excited when I found it, but as you see, the little gem popped out and it's actually not a gem, it's a piece of plastic. <laughs> so I doubt this is anything real. It actually looks a little green on the back, but I will test the little diamonds anyway and we could see if they're real or not. I don't have high hopes for this one either. Nope, this is fake too. I had a feeling about this one though. Oh well. We still have a silver and gold find today, so I'm very happy with that. I can't complain. This place is super beautiful, so it's a win-win. So guys, I have some sad news unfortunately. I was flying my drone trying to get some cool shots of the Catskill Mountains. It's so beautiful here and I thought I checked all around. I thought I checked my height but unfortunately 
I was too low and as I was panning to get a shot of one of the mountains, I slammed into the tree. It got stuck at the very tip of the tree at first and then I, I could still see it on screen, it fell. If I could get the video for my phone, I think my phone backs up the video in uh, 720. I'll show you guys. It got stuck on top, then it fell a little lower, and I went searching for this thing. I literally climbed up a sheer cliff looking for it. The closest I ever got to it was 40 feet, which means I was probably right under it, even though I couldn't see it. But it was just so high up in the tree that even if I did see it, there's no way I could get it down. So, unfortunately, I lost my beloved drone. I had that thing for almost three years, if not more, I think but I'm gonna have to get a new one because I really enjoy getting drone shots. I'm always very careful, but I did it. I finally, I finally crashed and lost it. For the drone, homie. I wanna say thank you guys so much to those of you who went and bought my merchandise after my last video. I was actually surprised how many people bought it. Um, I still don't have all the designs up that I want yet. I'm still working on them, but still you guys went and you bought a bunch of things. Thank you so much. That really means a lot to me. I'm wearing my white on white basic Svet logo hat and I have this towel I used today, I forgot. It's pretty big. White's not the best color for what I use it for, but this would be a good house towel. And uh, the new towels I designed, they're perfect for outdoor use because they're very colorful and you won't be able to tell if they get dirty. So that's probably better for in home, but I'm using it anyway. <laughs> Definitely gonna get it dirty though, but oh well. All right guys, this wraps it up for today's video. Give it a thumbs up if you've enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new. Buy the merch if you want to support the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! so sad. Let's have a moment of silence for the drone. Is this bedrock? I wonder if there's any gold in here. It was bone numbing, finger tingling, freaking cold. Now you see me, now you don't. Now you see me, now you don't.